So, what the hell is that sound in the ceiling? Here we have a giant Murphy patternless female. Uh, she is Hetford Tremper. She's an outcrossing of, oh geez, what was it? Oh, she is a leftover from testing the pure Murphy pattern list that I had. So she is from the pure Golden Gate. The pure, okay, without doing the whole hypocritical claiming lines thing, she is from a pure Murphy pattern list that was produced by Golden Gate Geckos. So Golden Gate Geckos Pure Murphy Patternless Project. Let's just say that instead of saying bloodlines because they all come from someplace else. But I got this girl from some, from actually Michelle at Rampant Reptiles who got her from Marsha at Golden Gate Geckos. So that's where I got the mother. It was one of the last ones that was that were uh, put for sale for the public. I mean, and that's that's a whole other bucket of worms because if you guys remember, Murphy Patternless pure ones and pure blizzards were just going for like 50 bucks, 50 to 100, you know, 50, 75, 100, depending on how nice they looked, which they all pretty much looked the same because that gene, those genes, just make them look plain like this, patternless, nothing to it, absolutely nothing. But then, you know, once uh, Matt from Sasebeck got uh, on the whole pure train, he was charging four to five hundred dollars for pure ones. So what he did was he got some from Marsha and then because he was more popular, you know, and having like, what, 20,000 likes on Facebook and all that crap. Even though he's not active now, he cashed in on that fucking milk cow. I mean, he pumped all these breeders for all they had, getting all this money out of them. Ugh, there's a lot of breeders that paid for animals and still haven't gotten them, like, two, three years later. So, you guys just gotta watch out when you're buying animals, what you're doing, because... That shit is crazy. But as you can see, her just coming out of brumation, she's not so interested in food right now. And her tail's not super skinny either. It's wider than the base. And she's, you know, just starting to get the shapes on her. So she's in the very, very, very early stages of uh, ovulations. So, yeah, that's this. Come on, get in the camera. You. People want to see you. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this little video and check me out later.